On today's episode, I am gonna show you how to make this fabulous jewelry tree from a styrofoam wig head. I can't wait to show you. To get started to make our jewelry tree, for our base we're going to be using a styrofoam head. You can purchase these at most uh, beauty supply stores and they're for around under $5 so this is a great bargain for this project. The next thing you're going to ne need is some tissue paper and I chose some Toile um, inspired tissue paper in black and white to go with the decor that I'm thinking to put this jewelry tree in. And once you get your tissue paper you're just going to go like this. We're going to wad it up, and um, let me just move this one out of our way. And the reason I do that, it gives it a nice texture. So we're just going to go ahead and spread it back out. And now I'm going to bring um, the styrofoam head. I've already started the decoupage on it for you. As you can see, I've decoupaged all the way around. And I also want you to notice I've decoupaged the bottom of the head as well. And I'll just show you really quick how fun and easy this is to do. Just simply dip your brush into your decoupage medium and brush it directly right onto the styrofoam. Then you're gonna tear your tissue into little pieces. And I actually like to have a whole pile of already torn tissue to do this. And I'm just going to then go back over the top with the brush and just work it into the styrofoam head. Now once you've used the decoupage medium covered the whole head and remember the bottom as well, let it dry. Once it's dried, come back in and do a whole nother coat over it, sometimes two, maybe three coats. When it's completely dry, now we're gonna have the fun to do the decorating. And how you're gonna start, as I'm gonna show you a few things that I found that's gonna work for my um, tree. I found this trim, it has a little bit of elastic pull, and it also has a little bit of webbing holes, and this is really important to hang the earrings on. And you just buy this by the yard. Then I have a really pretty ornament for the side, some cup hooks, these great ostrich feathers, and some really pretty um, sparkly ribbon, and then a five inch candlestick holder. And they sell these in the craft store as well. Some pins, glue gun, little pair of scissors, and you're ready to go. So what we're gonna do, I've already did my measurements on my um, elastic. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of hot glue on. And let me show you from the back. There we go. We're just gonna put this on. Be careful because remember we have those little holes. And this is where I like to use the pin. And these are little tiny, these pins have little tiny um, balls on them. So they're just gonna disappear anyway. And that's just gonna hold it securely as I go around. So then I'm gonna bring the elastic band around because you can tell I'm doing a kind of a flapper style um, look to it right above the head. And now I'm going to bring the hot glue gun in and a little bit more hot glue here and I'm just gonna keep going around. And if you need to, you can then again use the pins and you can always pull them out. So I'm gonna finish this up and then we're gonna keep on decorating. The trim is glued all the way around the head and now I'm gonna come back and give it an accent piece with some sparkly ribbon. And the same thing, a little bit of hot glue and you're just gonna put it on as you go around. And you don't have to hot glue all the way around, but just in parts of it as you go. That'll just hold it on nice and secure. Sparkly glittery ribbon is all the way around the head and now it's time to come in with the feathers. And here, again, a little bit of hot glue on the feather. You're gonna place it on the side and you're just gonna press that on. You're gonna come back in with another. I like to use three feathers. If you can find them in a graduating sizes is really great. I'm gonna do this one a little bit because you know remember kind of doing a little flapper kind of esque look and we'll come back with our third one it's going to go right in the middle look how fun that is oh i'm so excited and then we're going to come back with our pretty um glittered piece just a little bit because i think this is going to stick off a little bit here we go our little applique just like that I kind of like that sticking up. I'm just going to hold that there. 
and now we've done our headband. I do want to point out if you do want to add a little piece of the glitter ribbon around the bottom, this would be a good time to do it as well. Our very last step is putting in cup hooks to hang the necklaces and bracelets and even watches from. And what I've done is I'm just going to take a nice little pair of sharp scissors and I'm just going to poke a hole right into the styrofoam. You see that? Not too far just so you know that's where it's going to go. I'm going to take the cup hook and I'm going to put some hot glue around the edge of the cup hook just like that and I'm going to go right into the hole and I'm just going to push it securely and just hold it for a second so the glue dries up. Now I'm going to add a couple more cup hooks and once I've done that then it's going to be time to glue it to the base of our candlestick holder which is going to just really jazz this up and make it a really great not only jewelry tree but a home decor piece. And how I'm going to do that is I'm going to put hot glue right around the top edge of the candlestick. I'm going to turn my tree upside down and I'm just going to go right in the very center. Hold that there for a second. You see how good that looks? Okay, great. And then when you stand it up, isn't that fabulous? Now it's time to hang your jewelry on. I'm going to bring back in our other jewelry tree and show you how fun. Here's the earrings. I'm going to show you how easy this is to just take a pair of hooked earrings to hang on like this. And then also your necklaces. This one's a bracelet. You can hang the bracelets on. And I just think it's a great um, tree for your jewelry and your watches and all kinds of things. And guess what? It's home decor on as well. Thank you so much and I hope you enjoyed this episode.